man, I had to qualify again. And I have to race right now because for some reason they didn't take my time. You got some water? Okay, it's a part of the game. Hello YouTube! I'm back! I'm back, but I'm slow because of this. <laughs> I had a big... I don't want to see anything. It's gone. Alright, I got the other one. Who cares? Welcome to the first race vlog of my Lease & Co. Something new, something different. It's like a new format and I will always do this when I will have new races. I went to the workout. I mean, I'm back now, but it was a good, good experience. I tried a lot of boards, I met a lot of people. I've seen a lot of great, great writers and I met even Jay Boston, who was the person who pushed me to be a YouTuber. I don't wanna bother you now, I don't wanna annoy you with anything. Let me show you something really special. Let's go in Paris. Good morning, YouTube. Me and where she is? <laughs> Sonia hey. Amort in the building. We are in Malpensa Airport, Italy. We are going to Paris for the Evo World Cup. Thanks to Majestic Boards and a lot of sponsors that is right here. I will put it later in the video. So, what are we doing today? We are going to Paris. I'm scared as fuck because this is my first big race. I don't know what I will see. And I got the new beast, uh, Majestic Pro X. Majestic Pro X Supreme, which is really, really good. Can't wait to test it, can't wait to try it. I'm scared because uh, I never had the chance to test it before the race. Then stop talking, I don't want to show you, I don't want to bother you, annoying you with, you know, airport footage, takeoff, landing. So what I'm going to show you is the Tour Eiffel just like Boom! <laughs> I'm in France right now. There's a lot of cool stuff. Athletes, vloggers, Jay Boston, Evo, Majestic Boros, La Croix, Lazy Rollers. We all here. We are here. In that hotel. Unfortunately, I don't have the board right now. I will have the board tomorrow morning. So today, I cannot enjoy the group ride with the other guys. I will sleep a little bit, shower, relax. I've seen the truck. Man, the truck of the street race of tomorrow. Ooh, fellas, it's so good. Quick turns. Dangerous. Like, we love... Uh, it will be nice. It will be really, really nice. Stop talking. Let me show you something. Okay, I'm already watching the other riders and I can feel the adrenaline coming up. I mean, I'm really scared at this moment. Probably you cannot see it in the vlog. This guy with the Kali board is really fast. I don't know how I can do it because it's bigger than me. Probably um, it's around 100 kilos because I'm 82. Trust me guys, it's really, really fast. I'm really scared at this moment. Probably you cannot see it in the vlog. But trust me, in that moment, I'm freaking out. You gotta be proud of it. There's a lot of people falling. This is the qualification. After the qualifiers, there's the race. Jay Boston is right behind me, guys. Thanks to this guy, I'll start vlogging. I don't know what to say, just, just take it in there. It's fun, isn't it? Okay. I'll take a look at the other riders. The level is really high. There's a lot of good people. There's a lot of good riders. There's a lot of great boards. I know that my board is good, but I don't know. Let's see what happened. For me now, it's time to get out of the truck for a little bit because I had no chance to try the board before and my sponsors has just arrived with the Majestic Pro X Supreme. That means that it's really, really fast. I got 48 volts under my S. It's really, really bigger than my first board. The first board has around 20 six volts this one is a beast okay it's the moment now i'm really scared as f and at test i just realized that the only way to start and be fast is grab the nose of my board and keep the hand right there because the board is really really fast i got a lot of torque i got a lot of power under me so i just need <laughs> just to stay there like this without moving or i will fly fly away Two, one, go. Go, 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 go. Okay, after the first lap, I got more feeling. I can feel the board. I know where I need to slow down, but 
There's something that I don't know it's just too fast. I'm not used to that speed because I never tried it before. I love this turn. This turn is the best one. This turn is really, really good. <laughs> Okay, let's watch it again. Looking at the video right now, now I know why I can barely walk. Now I know what I got this. I'm glad that there's nothing broke. I mean, my bones are still good, but damn, what a crash. All right, let me watch it again. <laughs> Wow, that's a huge crash. Damn. God. Oh. Well done. <laughs> I fucked up the deck. It's broke. It's completely gone. I don't know how I did it, really. I just, I'm just trying to understand what is going on here, but probably I'm a bit pissed because I was really fast. It never happened to me before. I don't know. Just let's keep watching and see what happened. For my training, I have a board with bamboo and fiberglass in it. This is a different wood. This wood is not designed for my weight and for all that pressure that I, that I put on the board, on the deck of the board when I'm carving. So the big problem is that I never tried the board before. So I don't know what's going on. Everything can happen. This is really simple. A lot of torque, a lot of power, a lot of pressure under my feet. The deck is not flexible, it's flat. I don't need a flexible deck. After four, five, six different carves at 40, 50, 60 kilometers an hour, it's too much for that deck. After this carve, after this quick turn, I feel that it's something that is not going in the right way. But I'm still riding, I'm fast. I wanna qualify for the race. I know that I can be faster. I know that I can be better than this. I know that I can push. I see the levels of the other rider and I know that I can do it. <laughs> Right here, if you take a look at the back of the board, if you take a look at the back of the deck, you can see that the board is really, really bent. It's almost broke. I don't see it, and so I keep pushing. I got just six turns before the finish line. I'm ready for the quick turn before the T3, before the fastest part of the truck. I'm too fast, and I'm putting a lot of pressure on this deck. <laughs> This is what happened. I'm really sorry for this. In this moment, I got a lot of things in my, in my head. Why? Why is this happening to me? Did I miss something? I was too fast. I put too much pressure on the board. The adrenaline is killing me because I really got no idea. I'm just trying to understand what the problem is, but in this moment, I'm not pissed. I'm sad because I was really, really fast. In this moment, I got just one thought in my head. It's finished. I will go home. I looked so bad in front of the other riders, in front of the best riders in the world, but I don't know what to think. I'm about to cry because I trained myself, my mind and my body for six months for this race. And I know that I can do better than this. I'm ready to go home, but at a certain moment, Cedric, the, the host of the event, Cedric from It's Electric is telling me, Yo, you still in. We took your time and the first two laps was good. So you still in, you, you gotta be ready for the second session. I said, Okay, now I gotta be quick. Okay, I'm alright by the way, I'm good! Did I have another one? A few moments later. Now I'm really scared. There's a lot of pressure on me. Everybody's watching me. My sponsor is watching me. Then I really, really need to be faster than a mother. I'm scared. I'm pumped up, but at the same moment I'm scared as f because I know that everything can happen now. This board is different than the other one. The mechanics has already changed the wheels for me and they fixed something, the deck is better. So now I gotta be really, really fast. Man, I had to qualify again and I have to race right now because for some reason they didn't take my time. You got some water? Okay, it's a part of the game. I took the 
first turn in a really good way. I feel comfortable. I'm confident. I'm going faster than this. I'm going faster than before. I'm getting better. I'm really better. People are bumping me. Everybody's saying, come on, go, go, Marley, push. And I'm pushing so hard. I'm trying to do my best in order to be one of the first riders in the race because this is the qualifying session. One mistake and I'm out of the workup. I got the adrenaline in me and the fear is coming out, but I gotta push, so I'm keep pushing. <sighs> I did it. I'm still in. I don't know if my time was good, but I'm still in. Everybody's applauding now. Everybody's saying good. Everybody's coming to me. You did it. You did it. That's good. I'm happy. I'm happy because first of all, I didn't crush. <laughs> I'm still alive. But the point is, I'm still feeling a lot of pain in my body. The adrenaline is going down right now. You know, I got a lot of pressure that is going down. It's going out of my body. So I'm starting feeling the pain of my side, on my bones, especially on my leg and on my back. Something is not going in a good way. And I started feeling it right now. This is not a good feeling. And the race, the race is not finished yet. Okay, uh, this is it, hold on. This board is another level of board. This looks like the board that I have in the blocks. But this one, guys, this one is a monster. This is really fat, really big. There's a lot of torque. I can barely stand on this board. I will practice a little more. I, I, I definitely believe that this board would be the board of the year because it can compete with DIY boards. That means that it can compete with boards that are not on the market. In order to avoid all this, I will do more tests, more roads, more roads, more off-road tests, and I'll be ready for the next year, okay? So guys, at the end of the day, at the end of the first day, I'm in for the race. In the afternoon, I will have the race that I always wanted to be in. I just want to say thank you to all my sponsors now. Everybody helped me. Everybody believed in me because Majestic Boards, Dolly Noir, Black Shop, Under Armour, Spartan Gym, Judge's Garden, Nixon. A lot of people believed in me. So this is the end of the vlog. I'll show you something really, really cool in the next episode. So stay tuned. You will see race one, race two, and a lot of really good thing that I can wait to show you. Marley and Co. I'm Marley. Bye. Let's go. Oh shit! Under the Majestic Ten, it's me with the monster. My inspiration, Mike the Monster. Just give me. Pleasure. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, he's a future. Take a look at this. How did you do that? Not oh, today. Just, just jump in. Yeah, 360, then you get it. Man, for my listen call, this guy is a future. Now you already know. You want to see the future? My listen call on YouTube. Click on the bell, subscribe. If you don't do it, I know where you're living. Bye. <laughs>